Hello, Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. I'm so sorry again for my voice. I guess it takes some time for me to recover from this cough and this sore throat. Other than that, I feel fine. Um, but anyway, uh, in today's reading, we're going to find out what is your person planning to say to you soon, okay? And I'm going to go slow with this reading. Um, spirits and angels, please show me for our signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. What is the person going to say to them soon? Ace of Swords, so they're planning to tell you the truth for sure. So the Strength card is the first was the first card that that came out. So your person could be a Leo, could be an Aries with the Fool here, could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, can be any sign, any five signs. I'm seeing his Sag, Aries, Leo. Okay, they're gonna let you know that they've been holding back from speaking with you, telling you the truth. Or opening up communication with you if both of you haven't been speaking with each other much um, because of the Queen of Swords because they think that you are going to tell them off or cut them off or that you're not gonna hear them out okay um, they fear you're gonna be very harsh towards them so they've been thinking a lot about you with the Nine of Swords here they've been thinking they've been thinking what to say to you how to say it to you so you would you wouldn't be the queen of swords towards them so you wouldn't be harsh towards them or that you wouldn't not want to hear them out or, or cut them off so they've been definitely holding back with the strength card also they might admit that they have a bit of an ego okay and the fool here is in world first they're gonna say to you that they've made a mistake and that they should have been more compromising with the three of pentacles uh, with the three of pentacles it feels like they're gonna admit their fault that they may have done something silly or that it was maybe silly of them to not meet you in the middle to not compromise with you and five of swords is right here five of swords is beneath the queen of swords here so for me this indicates them have been thinking long and hard whether to fight for this connection or let it go um also Mm. with the four of cups here beneath the five of swords they are going to say to you soon that the reason why they have been holding back from telling you something or from speaking with you um, it is because they want to avoid any sorts of drama okay and also four of cups and the three of pentacles here um, they also would like to say to you soon that they've been focusing on your work and they they have been doing their best to try and ignore you because they want to avoid again five of swords any any sorts of confrontation or drama, but they've been thinking again a lot about you. They've been stressing out. There have been a lot of worries in regards to maybe their work situation with the three of pentacles, unless if there's someone else, if there's a third party involved, then they could have been worrying about you know this whole situation this this whole third party situation if there's a third party that's just for some of you okay if there's no third party the three of pentacles here feels like maybe they've been trying to solve some issues at work uh, again it could be related to their career and we've got the ten of wands here so they're gonna tell you soon that things have been super hard for them and they've been carrying a lot of burden it may have something to do with work again if it's not work it could be a, a a myriad of things right could have it could be related to work three of pentacles or could be them carrying the guilt of making a mistake here in the past with the full in reverse being foolish or unable to come to you and compromise with you one second earth signs <coughs> here we go again it's my cough so we've got the five of wands here hmm. Yep, 
Um, they're gonna tell you soon that they've been again with the Nine of Swords worrying uh, about the drama that would ensue or drama that has happened in the past, okay? So something that they're trying to walk away from. Ten of Wands walking away from their worries, uh, walking away from thinking too much about you or uh, any sorts of drama or fights that both of you have had with each other with the Five of Wands here. Hmm. Uh-oh. One second, please. I forgot to do something. <laughs> forgot to set the stopwatch. I'm going to pull out a few more here. And also the oracles later. The star. Okay. So eventually they would like to tell you the truth with the ace of swords here. So they also want uh, to say to you that they want to cut off all the whatever that may have happened in the past. Let's forget about the drama, the fights, um, and the silly things that may have happened between the two of you. Or it could be a third party. If there is a third party, they're going to tell you soon that they're cutting the third party off. And, you know, Aces indicates a new beginning. So they want to have this new start with you. And Four Pentacles in Reverse indicates them also will be telling you in the near future that, or soon, that they are, again, uh, letting go of mistakes from their past or third party. Or also to open up... Um, to be more open towards you, to tell you the truth again, to be completely honest with you and to clarify things to you, whatever that may have been bugging them with the Nine of Swords here, okay? Um, and we've got the star here. So they're going to say to you soon, or signs, that with the star here, that <laughs> they find you to be very attractive. And they're very clear that you are somebody whom they've always been wishing for, whom or whom they've been wanting to heal and recover from all of this mess of chaos that have happened between the two of you with the five of wands here. So they definitely would like to start over with you, healing, recovery, and they're hoping that you will understand them. Um, they hope that both of you could could be honest with each other this time around. Yeah, for Pentacles and Reverse. And to again let go of whatever that may have happened between the two of you and then come together as a team, work together as a team to rebuild the foundation of this connection or to rebuild this connection in general. They also will give you, I feel like they're gonna also tell you how great you are, how much you have achieved, um, something about them feeling proud of you as well they may also tell you something in regards of their insecurities uh, where they may think that you're out of their league and maybe you're just too good for them hence you know all of these uh, fool here these this card silly things that they may have said or done it could be like due to their ego they could have been self-sabotaging themselves because they may want to one-up you, right? Five of Swords here. But they know they can't one-up you. Because you are the star and you are the Queen of Swords here. So now they are regretting, right? That they may miss this opportunity with you. But they've been trying to move on. They will tell you this soon. That they've been trying to move on. But they've been really conflicted. They really don't want to move on from you. With the final ones here. Um, but they would like to have this new start with you instead. Yep. The two of Wands here at the bottom of the deck. They will also be telling you soon in regards to the future. Because this person is carrying, holding this, uh, what do you call? This globe here. So they'll talk about the future with you. And they're going to leave it to you to make this decision. Whether you're going to come on board with them. Or are you going to say no. Okay. I'm going to pull out a few of these oracles. The timing just wasn't right for us. I feel like it was maybe due to work to your pentacles or maybe they were still getting over somebody from their past. Um, they may tell you about the third party if there is a third party. The third party could be because of work, you know, external factors or internal factors. It may have something to do with them, you know, being the fool here in reverse or not wanting to take 
risks. Maybe they thought the timing was not right because it would be too risky to be with you. Or it could be just because they were either insecure or that they were egoistic. They haven't grown up yet. They may be kind of immature. They didn't know um, how to meet you in the middle. They didn't know how to compromise with you. I remember every detail of that day. I feel like it, this may have something to do with the Nine of Swords. So they may be telling you soon um, that what they've been thinking uh, in regards of when what what you have said to them with the Queen of Swords here. You may have said something to them. You may have cut them off. And whatever you've said to them, I think they still haven't forgotten about that. And they will tell you that it, it has hurt them and it has given them uh, insomnia, anxiety. I wish I could take back my words. So maybe in retaliation they may have said something to you or didn't say something to you which they are currently regretting I look for you everywhere I feel like they could also be wondering uh, where are you now where have you been what are you doing okay I'm afraid to contact you so most likely again this is someone whom you haven't really been speaking with because they're afraid they're afraid again with the Queen of Swords here that you may tell them off or that you may cut them off, you may block them. Um, give me one second. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yep, you don't know how hard it was to let you go. So they're gonna they're gonna say this to you that it's been hard for them to try and walk away from this connection or to walk to let you go. I know I messed up everything, so something that they have done with the fool here in reverse. <coughs> that right now I feel like they may, sorry about that, they may think that it was a mistake, that it was a very, very silly mistake. I feel like it was due to their ego again with the strength card here. I regret lying to you. They may have lied to you in regards of how they feel about you. Uh, or some of you, maybe they did lie to you in regards of a third party situation. Or, you know, they try, again, it feels like you could be dealing with someone very egoistic. So they may not want to tell you the truth or tell you anything to make them seem weak or look weak. Unless they did lie to you in regards of a third party. Okay, that's for some of you. <coughs> Excuse me. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you with the nine of swords. Yep, they have insomnia, they have anxiety. So earth signs, they've been thinking a lot about you. They'll tell you all of these things. Yep, four of pentacles in reverse. They will bear their soul. They'll make it very clear. I see them not hiding anything from you anymore after um, they expose their thoughts to you and their feelings towards you. All right, Earth signs. <clears throat> My apologies for the cough. Um, it's going to take me a while to get rid of it. <laughs> but anyway, take care. Hope to see you back here next time. You guys know I post your videos almost every single day. There are more videos I've posted uh, for you guys. Collective reading with different questions, different topics. Check them out in the bonus compilation reading playlist as well if you want to. And also, I'm open for personal readings. Yesterday, I just did a few personal readings too, and I'm like, you know, a little bit, um, still, I think it takes me a while to, to recover also because I've been working a lot. But anyway, take care. Hope to see you back here next time. Bye, Earth Signs.